Okay, this is my first video of working on my house. I've been meaning to do them. Uh, today I'm prepping these panes of glass, which I salvaged from an old storm door, and I'm glue chipping them to go in my cabinet doors. Should look real nice. Um, so I got these hints from my sister, Teresa Fall. She does stained glass and stained glass classes in Albany. Google her if you're interested in either taking classes or buying some of her beautiful stuff. Now, ordinarily I wear contacts, but I didn't today because I was nervous about the dust, which isn't too bad, but it's a good idea, just in case, wear your dust mask. I'm using an ordinary um, orbital sander with 60 grit sandpaper. And I gotta warn you, you're gonna go through these like a stoner goes through Doritos. So what you do, I have a damp cloth here. Okay, it needs to be thin. You don't want a big fluffy towel. Just a nice thin rag. And then you take your glass, put it down on that. Uh, my sister says you can clamp it if you want to. I find that leaning on it with one hand works really well. And you really got to put some elbow grease on it. Don't be afraid to press down hard. Don't be afraid to use the edges. And you kind of keep an eye as you're doing it to make sure everything's getting cloudy. So here we go. from time to time and look all of it should be cloudy and if you see any clear spots you really need to dig into them some more so let's get some more in this your pressure on just flat. Go ahead and lean it a little bit and generally around the edges is where I have trouble but you get the idea and my sister didn't tell me to do this but just to double check I rinsed them off and put them in a drain board to dry and I'm going to give them another look and give them another sanding if I need. So this is step one of my glue chipping and I'll be back later to show you step two. 